Green flag flies. We are racing at Mid Ohio. Contact. Little bump. Saw some body work flying. And it's Austin Cindric. Oh, but look at Cooper. Star. Look at Cooper. He's going to try and stick it to the outside. He may have done it. He does. He's got the track position. Brent's going to fight him hard. But we're on cold tires, remember. Then it's going to be a run down the hill to turn six. And Cooper through Perez. Look at Eversley. Oh, a huge move by Eversley and O'Connell. Inside a height cutter. Wow, what a move by Ryan Eversley. Look at Cindric's car. Big damage to the left front. But you got to be careful if that suddenly comes underneath that left front tire when he's trying to turn through a corner. I think the stools will look at this. If it doesn't dispatch itself pretty soon, they may bring him in. Oh, that's tight there. Cindric pushes it down to the inside. That bodywork's going to be right into Fogarty, and it clears it. I think it tore the bodywork off did. of Cindric. And he's now got probably a healthy race car minus the downforce. Now we're going to go back and take a look, as we always do, at the GT Cup start, which happened separately. And here is the start. And uh, Yuri with that pole cow, it was huge for him to get a run down into the first turn. And he was able to do that. But Fergus Hungry took a look. He did take a look from that third position, but it's settled down right now. Udell but to the front. And there's a look at Alec Udell leading in GT Cup. And uh, he was able to get through and uh, make that move on Yuri. Boy, but once he got through, Cal, look at the margin he's been able to open up. Well, suddenly, Austin Sindrick just slowed. Well, Jeff, I believe you've got some information from the pits. As a matter of fact, Sindrick has come to a stop, Jeff. Well, Darren Law, we've seen Austin Sindrick starting dropping back. Is there a problem with the car? Yeah, we've got a mechanical issue with the boost. So we're, we've got it on telemetry, trying to resolve what the issue is. But right now, we haven't got it fixed. So. Um, you know, we got to hang in there and try and get some points out of this. We've been talking about the attack Pompelli's been putting along. He finally got it done and down into our stop tech brake zone, but it wasn't easy. Oh, no, he was deep on the brakes, and Pat Long's going to hold tight there around the outside. Thinks better of it. You can see Pompelli. He's got all the weight moving forward. He was dancing the rear end there. Threshold braking, ABS kicking in. Just gets the move done. Madness, Traffic for oh Cooper. Boy, this here is we big. Go. Eversley, if he can time the... Oh, nice move by <laughs> Cooper. The door just opens up. Now Calvert lets him through. Oh, and Perrin's going to sweep around. Oh, he didn't. I don't wow. think Preston realized there was no. a third car in that line. That was big. That was yeah. our championship leader going for a ride there. A lot of grass in the radiator grill right now. Now Perrin's able to get down and underneath, but look at that, Cal. Just absolutely packed. Brent struggling here in the straightaway. O'Connell flicks to the outside. I think Brent's got issues. He seems to be slowing. Brent way off the pace, Cal. Yeah, he's got to be. Oh, oh the, the engine's gone, I think, Greg. I think those sparks may yeah. be coming from the exhaust, possibly. The front grill full of grass where he had that off coming onto the front stretch here. Car was overheating. Unfortunately, it looks like he is done as he's getting ready to crawl out. No, they put the seat belts back on, tell him to go as they try to get as many points as they can. Your race winner here yesterday. Look at this, Pompelli's the fastest man on the racetrack right now, trying to make a move on the Red Dragon, the gains go entry of John Fogarty. Mike McCann splitting the two leaders Someone's right off, oh, big time. Off. That's, That's the Fong. Bentley. Was he trying to make a move on Pat Long? It's the Fong Long show again, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Joe Toussaint has had a quick spin. And looking here is your leader still in GTA, Shine Fuentes, not letting him get too far down the road, but here we go. Last time through the carousel, Michael Cooper feeding his way onto the front straight, and Michael Cooper is going to bring home another win at Mid-Ohio. That's impressive, and his second win of the season.